In this short demonstration, we will show how Team Center Express helps improve your productivity for completing everyday tasks for design through manufacturing, with a special focus on the enhancements in the latest release, Team Center Express version 5. We start by logging in to Team Center Express. The user interface has been extensively updated and takes advantage of many improvements in the underlying Team Center 8 platform. We select the search command and you can see that the user interface adapts to support the selected task. We specify that we want to search for an item with a specific item ID and execute this search. The search returns a single item and you can see that the key properties are displayed in the summary tab for easy access. A preview graphic is also displayed. This helps validate that the correct item has been selected. For easy future retrieval, we paste a link to this item to our home area. Each user has their own home area that is typically used to store links to commonly accessed data. Note that the user interface is divided into three logical areas. The navigation panel is on the left, the explorer panel is in the middle, and the data panel is on the right. As an example of simple configuration of the user interface, we turn off the navigation panel, leaving more screen space for the explorer and data panels and we then send the selected item to the viewer. Team Center Express includes Team Center visualization for best-in-class visualization, analysis, and markup of 2D documents and 3D parts and assemblies. 3D models from popular CAD systems are automatically rendered into lightweight JT models for improved performance and open access. We return to our home area and select an item that re represents an axle assembly. Again, the preview image helps confirm that we have selected the correct data. When we expand the item, we can see the associated data sets and item revisions. This enables a user to quickly see all the data that describes a particular part. We send the assembly to the new Structure Manager module. This module has been expanded in version 5 to enable management of folder and document structures in addition to product structures. Here we can see all the sub-assemblies and components that make up this axle assembly. We open the viewer panel inside the structure editor and select the assembly components that we want to be displayed. In this example, we select the top level assembly to display the complete product. We activate a control that enables us to rotate the assembly so we can examine it in more detail. We then zoom in around one area of the assembly. And finally, we fit the assembly in the view area and exit the view panel. Now we select the Impact Analysis tab. We can use this to find out what other data is associated with this item, and we can filter this data by the type of link. In this case, we use the Where Use filter to find out what higher level assemblies reference the axle subassembly. Here we find that the axle assembly is referenced by one higher level assembly, and we can right click on this assembly to perform operations on it. Now we send the axle subassembly to the Lifecycle Viewer module. This is a new module introduced with Team Center Express version 5 that brings together view, analysis, and markup capabilities in a single interface. Some of the analysis commands available include 3D measurement and placing PMI information. In this example, we select the 3D cross sectioning command. We specify the orientation of the cross-section plane and the option to remove the material on the viewer's side of the cross-section. We control the position of the cross-section plane using a slider and we can still rotate and zoom the image of the cross-sectioned assembly. We now return to our home area and create a new revision of the axle assembly. This is just one example of the many wizards that Team Center Express uses to guide users through the completion of everyday tasks.
the new revision is automatically linked with its master item and displayed in our home area. We select this revision and select the workflow process command to create a new workflow instance for this revision. Team Center Express includes a comprehensive electronic workflow capability that ensures the right data is delivered to the right people at the right time. We can also use our inbox to see if we have any workflow processes that we are required to take action on. In this example, we find that we have a task in our Tasks to Perform folder. We review the contents of this task and the associated data using the tabs in the data panel. Finally, we now sign off on this task to move it to the next stage in the workflow process.